It's wild, 20 years. Um, couldn't ask to finish on a better note. I've done everything I've ever wanted to do. Um, I'm very happy. I don't know, that's about all I got for you guys right now. <laughs> I'm kind of, uh, I don't know, it's, it's hard for me to grasp everything right now. You know, I'm not sure where my emotions are, but um, I don't think everything is really hidden or I guess struck me yet of what's happened, but um, I'm sure over the next couple of days, things will really start to settle in. I don't know, I'm just retiring. <laughs> um, no, you know, it's one of the biggest things that I've, I've always wanted or I've always said to myself is, I'll never swim at the age of 30. Uh, I want to be done before I'm, you know, I hit the age of 30. And, and, you know, one of the biggest things is that, you know, I know if I go three more years, it, then you just go another one. But um, that's just something I've always said throughout my career. And, and, you know, I've been very fortunate to be able to look back at my career and say I've been able to accomplish every goal that I've ever wanted to. And, and you know, I think at that point in your career, I think it's just, it's just time to move on. Um, you know, there are other things that I want to do in my life, and, and, um, and I'm, I'm not sure staring at a black line for four hours a day is one of those. <laughs> I just kind of feel like right now this is just like a, a normal, typical, you know, end of a meet. You know, my last swim is the, normally the relay, so it's just, uh, it's weird to think that, you know, that was my last swim ever. Uh, but it's something that you know I'm very happy for and 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 very proud of and and you know when I went into warm up for my second time, I walked into the warm up pool and there was nobody in there and I was like this is really strange I was like you're used to seeing like ten or fifteen people in a lane and you know you're like fighting for a spot to to sort of do your fast stuff and do your pace stuff and sort of get your stroke ready and and um, I mean there was probably 20 lifeguards sitting around or 20 workers sitting around on the, on the side of the pool and I just walked in and I was the only one in the pool so it was it was kind of a weird feeling because I've never seen that at a big meet so um, and I was the last one to swim in the warm-up pool and it's kind of cool. I just um, I just wondered what you thought this would mean for the people at home as they recover from the shootings in, in Aurora? Mm -hmm. Um, I hope this means a lot to them. I have constantly been thinking about them this whole time, and I've said it, and I will say it again, that everything I did here is dedicated to them. It was so, so terrible what happened, and it's still hard to believe that it really did happen. And I hope that I was able to bring some smiles back to Colorado and the supportive tweets and Facebook posts that I've been getting. So many people have been saying that I've been doing that, and that just means the world to me.